Hey, what's you guys? It's the Barbie, and I'm back with another video. If you're a returning subscriber, hey, if you're new here, do not forget to subscribe and join the bougie crew because it's the bougie way or no way. Perry A. Today, I am back with another hair review slash hair tutorial, and I am wearing Unice Hair. This is their 24-inch body wave wig, 150 density, I believe. If not, everything on this wig is going to be in the description. Um, love this hair. Um, I had... What I did for my waves, I put, um, I sprayed it with water and I put, um, foam in my hair to actually keep, like, the waves. So, that is that. Um, so we're pretty much, just, we're pretty much just about to get straight into the video. Y'all already know the vibes. Um, baby hairs. Obsessed. Okay. Obsessed. Like, I've gotten so good at baby hairs. Like, I'm so happy because it used to take me, like, so long to do my baby hairs because I just couldn't get them right. Like, they used to be too thick. They used to be too, like, but now, like, these are, I love these. They're, like, they're super natural. They're not too thick. They're perfect. So, if you want to see how I got this look with this hair. Oh, in the video, I did not do half up, half down. I did this today because I'm filming the intro, like, two days later. So I'm sorry, but if you want to see how I got this look with the baby hairs and how I installed this bomb body wave wig, then continue watching. And don't forget to let me know what y'all think in the comments. I love y'all so much. Enjoy. Okay, so the wig came in this red box and it came with a, um, a wig cap, a black wig cap, which I didn't use, and an adjustable strap to basically make the wig tighter. Right now, I am just cutting holes um, by the ears so that way my cap can lay flat and I'm going to spray it with got to be free spray and blow dry it until it is dry. I'm going to be taking my uh, powder in the color ebony and I'm going to be putting it um, over the front of the cap and then once I'm done with that I'm going to cut the cap cut the remaining of the cap off Okay, so here's the wig. It is so pretty and full. This wig has two, um, two combs on the side and one comb in the back. Now instead of bleaching the knots, I'm just going to go in and use my powder and put it over the lace. Okay, so wig is on, so now I'm just adjusting it and cutting it where it needs to be cut by the ear. So that way that I can um, go ahead and um, lay the uh, front lace down. So now I am lifting the front of my lace and applying my Bougie Barbie hair gel. Once 
once you lay the lace flat like basically into the product go ahead and use your um, freeze spray and your blow dryer and comb the product comb the hair and the lace into the product so that way it will stick and you're just going to do that on each side Okay, so now it's time to cut the lace. Make sure when you cut your lace, you cut in a zigzag motion. And you can do this in sections, but I just do one side and then I do the other side. some remaining parts that did not lay down with our gel and free spray before so we're just gonna go in and spray the free spray on the parts that did not lay down and blow dry it Now I'm going to go in and do some plucking. Um, what I'm doing here is just parting a thin layer of hair from the front um, and both sides and I'm just going in and plucking to my liking. Plucking is a lot of hard work and it takes forever. So I don't really pluck everything when I'm filming. I usually go in even after the video and still go in and pluck more. My arms be hurting y'all, so. <laughs> back just to see how it looks so far. You have to be very careful with plucking because you can over pluck and you will have a ball spot. I had a ball spot on the side but I fixed it so you couldn't really tell too much. <laughs> Now I'm just brushing out what I plucked so I can go ahead and move forward. Now I'm going to take my alcohol and a cotton ball and clean around my hairline because you can see all the free spray that has dried up and it dries up white. So that's what I'm cleaning up. Now 
I'm gonna go in and style my hair, basically do my middle part, um, so I can go ahead and do the baby hairs next. So what you're gonna see me doing in this next step is parting my hair and putting using my Bougie Barbie wax stick and my hot comb to lay my hair down flat. from the front and both sides and I'm using my foam wrapping lotion from the beauty supply and I'm just laying my edges okay that's all I'm doing in these next steps now the way I lay my edges is how I lay my edges you do not have to do it the way I do it okay the way I do it I like how I do it okay period let me just say that <laughs> them so they won't be too thick you always want your baby hairs to look natural okay I literally always do one side better than the other. I hate that. <laughs> now I just use my silk scarf and lay my edges down for about 10 minutes. Just so they'll set in place. And then um, basically there you have it. They lay down really good. They look really good. I love how they came out. And I do go in and brush them out so they won't be just like stuck to my head. They'll look super natural. For the final step, we're gonna take our Bougie Barbie wax stick again and just lay, um, put it all over the front and on the sides and lay our hair down really flat with the hot comb. I will be dropping my waxes very soon um, because I know y'all been asking, they coming soon, I promise. But this is going to be the end of the video. These next few clips, I'm just gonna be posing, you know, looking good, that's it. <laughs> but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. Bye, babes. Thank you.